Okay, good evening, welcome. It's Adam Southend Guy back again, and I've headed over to Canvey uh, for what I think is the fourth time. <laughs> uh, I haven't given up on this base yet, there's still quite a bit more to, uh, to be dug up here, but I think um, this episode and the one that will be following will probably be the last ones that I do um, as regard the sea, in, um, you know, the, the sea wall areas, as it were. You can't really call them beaches because they don't have any. <laughs> they're just a lot of stones um, but uh, yeah this episode and the next one will probably be the last ones that I do uh, I may come back at some point possibly next year to do another one where the um, the bomb crew uh, were so that may be a possibility but that will be for some time in the future it won't be for, ne for any of the following episodes um, so yeah where I am tonight is uh, or just over the wall from a pub called the Lobster Smack. Now, the thing with the Lobster Smack is uh, it is all, all the original footprint of that pub has been there for literally hundreds of years. Um, Rumour has it that uh, Charles Dickens um, used it as a model for Sluice House in, or was it Sluice Gate in Great Expectations, and also um, rumoured that uh, Charles Dickens also rumoured that. Uh, there's smuggling going on here. Um, now, if you look up how smugglers worked back in the you know 1780s, even up to I think there's a report even up to the 80s, uh, which would have been tobacco. Uh, well, they were bringing it in here because uh, if they took it into London, they had to pay uh, all sorts of tariffs and that. So if they're bringing it, here, they'll drop a load off here and then run into London with the rest of it. That's what I've read. Um, I'll leave links in the description so you can have a good read up and uh, see for yourself. But um, yeah, so a lot of history here. We don't exactly know what. There's no, again, there's no reports of any paranormal activity here, but as we found before, areas that are rich in history, um, we tend to find a bit of energy. So uh, let's see what happens. So again with me tonight, we've got Ricky and Tracy who are just Hello. here. Hello. And uh, yeah, we're going to crack on. So I'll be back with you in a sec, and uh, I'm just going to sit up. Okay, right. So we're back with you um, now. Yeah. Just, oh, yeah, it does move. <laughs> <laughs> There's no benches here, so I'm improvising on a trolley that moves. Oh, funny, we could push this up and down. It'd be great fun. I can't. It's locked. But we're not going to do that. Um, so um, yeah, we've just done uh, all the usual bits. Um, Rampod is just set to the right of me. Uh, I'm going to put the meter on in a sec and uh, we'll see what happens. So, without further ado, now I changed the battery in this earlier, so I was a little bit concerned there might have been an issue there uh, with it, it was probably my eyesight when it was over. Oh, some cavity, I thought one of these lights was going dim, but um, just be on the safe side, so I swapped it. So, on we go, there we are, that's on. Now, if we've got any energy, any spirits, any entities that are here. If you was a smuggler, anything like that, if you want to make yourself known, you can come stand next to me, you can set the lights off on my meter. I do not mean you any harm and disrespect, all we want to do is get a bit of communication. That's all we want to do. So if you want to set these lights off, come tell me you're here. Now you may hear a bit of noise in the background, that is a boat. Um, I don't think I'll turn this. I'll turn this camera around after we've done our first bit so you can see exactly what the setting's like. Um, I did come down there, uh, when was it, Thursday I think? I did come over here and take some photos and uh, a bit of video so you can get an idea of what the area's like. So, have we got any spirits or entities that are here? particularly any smugglers. If you were here, you want to make yourself known. Come and talk to me. I'm not going to hurt you. All we've got to do is come and light my mates up. That's all we've got to do. Can you come and light my mates up? Use whatever energy you've got. Come and set your mates up. It's 
ding. That was a pin dropping. Hmm. Okay. So we put out the call once again. If you are an energy, you are a spirit or an entity. You want to come and talk to us. You want to come and make yourself known. All you've got to do is lock my mates up. Let me know you're here. That's all you've got to do. You're cheering me up because I've seen this thing go off for a little while. <laughs> Unless I put the phone next to it. Or stand next to a light. going to also listen out for any other noises that isn't the water going or boat. Um, from the previous Canary episode um, you may have noticed that I pointed out a little EVP thing that I picked up so I'm um, also going to keep an eye for that. Okay, I was just going to ask one more time. Anything here wants to tell me that you're here? Come and lock my meter up. Come and tell me you're here. That's all you got to do. Any energy you got, shoes it, make the money, I'll make light up. <coughs> oh, and you might hear some birds as well. I just said, it is squawking. Which I'm assuming the seagulls. Okay, so I think we're going to go to the um, Dowsing Rods next. I will leave that on. Leave it there. I think it's still in camera shot. We're going to go to these next. Okay. Just lovely and still weird tonight. There's any spirits that are here? If you're a spirit or an entity, and you want to make yourself be known, you can let me know that you're here by crossing my dowsing rods. I mean, no harm, no disrespect at all, we just want to communicate. That's all we'd like to do. If you're a spirit, particularly that of a smuggler, and you want to tell me you're here, cross my dowsing rods. spirits at all that are here. You can let me know you can come across my rods. Tell me you're here by crossing my rods. You're pointing to the right, so should I move over that way? No, it's to the left now. Okay. okay. If you prefer to talk to a lady, if you prefer to talk to a female, can you point in the direction of Tracy with my right one? If you want to talk to Tracy instead. Yeah. <laughs> you're not from Canvey, you're too posh. Okay, so that's just uh, this. Alright, okay. Alright, thank you. Um, I'm just going to try one more question. Mm. 
That's certainly not a dog. He drew it. Could be a fox. Yeah, it could be. I mean, he might be behind the, the wall. Um, yeah, you've got the lobster smack, but there's a lot of filters and stables and things, so. It's gonna, that was my stomach. Everyone <laughs> says, what's that? <laughs> I'm not hungry. Okay. Yeah. Oh, another one now. Yeah. I went out of milk earlier. Anyway, we're going off topic. <laughs> oh, topic. There goes chocolate. Right, I'm just going to ask one more time. If you are not, not the spirit of the smuggler, if you were someone else, you want to tell me you're here, what's my dowsing was to tell me you're here. If you're not the spirit of a smuggler, Last one more time. If you're not the spirit of a smuggler and you want to tell me you're here, cross my rights. I do not want to hurt you at all. And you absolutely no harm. I just want to talk to you. If you've got another spirit that isn't a smuggler, cross my rights and tell me. Um, if, if you were someone that didn't want to talk to people that you pay tax to, you can cross my rods and tell me yes. If you prefer to avoid the tax man, yeah, the duty. Yeah, if you didn't want to pay duty and you brought off goods here, you can cross my rods and tell me that's that's what happened. So yes, you did want to avoid the duty man. Did you want to do that? If that was the case, cross my rods and say yes. Yeah. It's not like right. there's probably anything that... Hmm. I think we'll just go straight to the spirit box by the looks of it, because um, I'm not... I'm not feeling anything. No, I'm not feeling anything. Right, so yeah, we're going to uh, cut the spirit box. I'll probably try and keep this a little bit brief again. Just for my own purposes, because um, although obviously these episodes go out once a week, I've done this is my fourth one this week, and we're doing the second can be one after this. So um, I'm a hell of a lot of editing. Right. Right. Okay. So uh, we're going to move to uh, the old necrophonic app. Um, before I start, just like reminding the spirits or entities that are here, uh, you cannot follow myself. Ricky or Tracy home, you cannot attach yourself to us, our equipment or possessions. So without further ado, I'm going to start. Uh, we are only here to communicate with you, we do not mean you any harm, we do not mean you any disrespect. So here we go. Right. So, it's not helps. If we do that. Okay. Are there any spirits or entities that are here and they want to talk to us? Devil. Devil. Did you hear that? No. I did. Eve. <laughs> any spirits here? Are they good or evil? Does that leave here? Mm. Okay. We use spirits that were do involved in, shall we say, smuggling activities. Were you involved in smuggling activities? Oops. Crap. Someone my name. Did someone say my name? Grab. Kids uh, taking pictures. Yeah. Yeah. So he said, yeah. What's your name? 
you go and quiet. You just, you just called my name, what's yours? You're still here. Who's still here? You. What is on? Are you going to tell me your name? Did you used to bring did you used to bring stuff into this pole? Did you did you, did you used to drop drop off shipping here? So I had a couple of years. What did you bring in? Spirit some beer. Gone. Gone. Makes sense. Not being bringing stuff in the bub. Glass pieces. Okay. When did you do this? Nine years. Nine years ago. Yeah. Or was it four nine years? What happened? Go through. What did you bring stuff in with? Here. Very okay. Did you go to the pub? Can I ask another question? If you would like to make yourself known, can you come and stand next to me? I've got a little machine here that'll tell me you're here. Who's, you're here now. Okay, can you use some of your energy to come and stand next to me? Stand to my right hand side. Easy. So I said my name again. That's not like how dumb. Whoever said my name, can you tell me yours? Bren. 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 Bren's possible. Okay. If your name is Bren, can you say yes? Yeah. Was you a smuggler, Bryn? Yes. Is that Bert? Yeah. Bert. Uh, you with an Ernie? <laughs> Sorry. Yes. 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 <laughs> I'm what dies. I'm so sorry. Didn't make no sense. Oh, dear. Okay, are there any messages you've got for us? One. What's that then? If you have a message, can you give it to us? I know you're still here. Yes. Are you at peace here? Go home. Go home. Would you like us to leave? With you. Would you like us to leave? I've got a no. Alright, so is there any other messages you have? Die. Who said die? Okay. Uh, 
Okay, alright, well, uh, I think this could be going down the summer. I think we might leave it at, um, leave it at that point now, from the sounds of it. Um, okay, to uh, all spirits we communicate with tonight, I'd like to thank you very much for your time. We mean you no harm or disrespect. Just, just to remind you, you cannot attach yourself to Ricky, Tracy, and myself. Follow us home. Or attach yourself to our possessions. Thank you. Yeah, that's um, sort of dark and what I've had before. But it's, I've, I've had that once or twice, like Shrewbury and Cash as well. Um, the responses were a little bit more negative, like that. Do you think because we laughed and they think we were making Disrespecting, fun of them, that is a possibility, yeah. absolute possibility. You've started it. Yeah. <laughs> Me? Ernie. Yeah, but they said the couple of negative things before I said that. So. Help <sighs> yeah, they, they said a couple of dodgy things before that, though. So. Yeah, I'm sort of. Uh, I sort of think, well, if this is going to go in a certain way, then you don't hang around. Do you no. So yeah, yeah, because it, if you get really, if they start getting sort of nasty, that's when they can attach and stuff. And what I've seen. Right, um, yeah, we're just going to move over to the uh, second site for what will be next week's recording. Um, but uh, yeah, just to give you an idea, and again, um, this is exactly what we're looking at here. It is very open, uh, as you would expect if you're on a. Do you know what? I can hear like um, not a cat. It's got a collar. A bell. With a bell. Yeah. Did you hear that? It's from boys out there. It's actually bells on them. Oh, that's a point. Yeah. It's only like a cat's bell. Okay. There you go. Right. Um, yeah. So that's it for this one, guys. So uh, it's a little bit short and sweeter. Um, but. Uh, Sometimes they go like that. And uh, if you like this, obviously don't forget to hit the like. Uh, give a subscription if you haven't done also. Uh, and obviously check my previous content because we've got quite a lot now. And um, yeah, that's pretty much it. So we will see you on the next one. Take care, goodbye.